Yo everybody and welcome to Let's Play Return of the Obra Din. I'm just going to start this game straight away. Uh, begin. And see how the game just jumps us in and see how things go. Lost at sea, 1803, the good ship Obra Din. Built 1796, London, 800 tons. 18 feet draught, Captain R. Uh, Ritwell, crew 51 men, last voyage to Orient Cape Renduvas Un Unmet. Oh, I didn't get to read. Tends to Chief Expector, Insurance and Claims, London Office. The Overton has returned dispatch to. Falmouth immediately and prepare a full assessment. So yeah. The ship Aldridin Aldridin has returned from being lost at sea and we are a uh, part of an insurance and claims person that has to go and check it out. Quite an ordinary <coughs> Falmouth, England. Company man woke me up. Said you'd need ferry to the Old Inn. Yes, please. Not many eager for that job. Uh, how come? Seems a bit late, if you ask. I didn't. Huh. Oh. What's in the box? I don't know. Hoist it up in a few minutes. Hey! How? Carefully. That's... Okay. Oh, so this is the game. And it's a very interesting art style that I really quite like. Uh, okay. So we're still at sea. This is the Obra Din. Man, this game is very... It's very bizarre. Like, visually. I quite love it. Ooh, there's a shiny over there. Okay. So, I have very little idea of what we're doing. Oh, wait, no, 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 no. I thought we were going to help him hoist it up. No? Okay. You have some very nice gloves on. I'm just assuming they're nice. Right, okay. Uh... Well then. No comment on the skeleton? Okay. Well, we're not going to go inside just yet. I mean... Check out around here. Oi! It's too heavy! Bitch! Huh. So I could... Okay. I'm just confused with the keys. Okay, so it's apparently too heavy. Can I help him somehow? Stop. It's too heavy. Okay. Take it yourself or open it here. Uh it's a book. At D. Return of the Oberdin. 
The Catalogue of Adventure and Tragedy. Preface. I trust that you now find yourself aboard the Oprah Din. I expect this day to come and my every intention was to t tell the sh ship's strange tale within the pages of this book. Regrettably, failing health has allowed me uh, to produce only the basic outline that follows. Your presence on the Oprah Din is critical. I leave the discovery of its fate and the completion of this book in your hands. Uh, the next few pages will seem bewildering at first. All will make sense in time. Use the pocket watch to determine the identity and fate of everyone on board. Complete each chapter accordingly and return the book uh, to the guaranteed post to the French by guaranteed post to the French offices office of affairs in Morocco. The bagging chapter will remain unknown to you. I possess the details within having what Keep. the baggage chapter will remain unknown to you I possess the details within but have elected to keep them private for now guessing like DLC potentially I don't know uh, oh man there's a lot of pages Okay, uh, so we can see the path and a nice. Oh wow, this is quite detailed. Uh, captain's quarters, passenger cabins, the gun deck. Oh man, the crew. Hey, Wales, Paul Moss. Not oh, another one, John Naples. First mate, steward. Sketches of life aboard. Ooh, justice at sea. Interesting. Loose cargo. Uh, go to the cargo deck. Lots of pages. Oh, how was that? Q table contents tab open close book. Oh, and it is like proper terminology. A uh, tab. Compass. Memento uh, morandum. Remember death. Okay. Thanks. So we'll try this again. I play it's, you know, relatively moony out. We go to here. Oh. That's kind of entertaining. Okay, so that sounds like the captain shooting this guy. Uh, let me have a look at his. Oh, okay.
Äh, Herrn. Wait. He was here. No. It's this guy then. He's one of the firing squad. Okay. This is presumably the captain. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, I guess time is up? The end? Who is this? How did they die? Person's face appears blurred throughout the book. Oh, okay. This blurn indicates that you don't yet have sufficient information to determine the identity. The fate may be known and can be entered now. Trying to name them while their faces blurred would be inappropriate, unproductive. Carry on and pay attention. Faces will become unblurred when the information necessary to identify them have been revealed in some way. Uh, well, he was shot. With a gun. By the captain? Captain, over the door, kick it in. Exactly what I give you. Location of the corpse. Yeah, because that's the captain's quarters. Others were present. Okay. So, this is the game. He... That's a bit weird. What's going on there? I... Can I... Take a look in your quarters? Okay. Something, remember, that could be blood or something. Let's do this door. Is this returning back to normal? This is so weird. Yeah, it is. Okay. Well, there's the axe. Uh. Must be in here someplace. <laughs> They're at the bottom of the sea. That's a lie. Oh, that's the captain again cutting the guy. Same guy. Ooh. Uh, hello. You're someone different. This is after this guy was shot.
Hmm. Okay. Inside the captain's quarters. Uh, he got decapitated alive, crushed, knifed. By the captain again. That guy is there. And we found the corpse of the other guy. Hmm. So, can we find if there's any more information up here? Oh, there is something. Or is that just the guy jumping down? I'm unsure. Yeah, that looks like it's just this guy. Hmm. Okay. So far, I'm still confused. There's the knife. There's nothing going on there. So could this be the captain? Oh, that sounds like strangulation. Oh, he got stabbed. Although that is totally a bludgeoning. Interesting. Will the world go all... Oh no, it does anyways. So it looks like I have a limited time to check everything. Huh. I don't know who he is, but he got burned clubbed? I would have said bludgeoned. Endless foes fell, exploded, eaten, electrocuted, poison shot, spiked, strangled, struck? No. Torn apart. Clubbed. Unknown enemy beast. Wait. Oh, did I not do it properly? Oh. Yeah, um, it didn't. Do 
don't know if it counted this or not. Right. Oh. Open the book when examining a face to flip directly to the sketch. Do I have sufficient information to determine this person's identity? Okay. This person's face is no longer blurred, which means they can now be identified. Okay. Use the book and the pocket watch to gather enough information to deduce their identity. We visit memories in the ship using the pocket watch to study relationships, appearances, and activities. Oh man. Use the book, map, crew manifests, and uh, artist sketches, along with the individual uh, conversation logs to find clues about. There were 60 people on the ship when it left England. Determining everyone's identity and fate will not be easy. Decisive information is rare. You have to make assumptions using part partial information. Some identities may only be revealed through the process of elimination. I'm bad at this. Good luck. Thanks. So this could be the captain. Or this could be the original captain that they mutinied against. We yeah, have a present. I guess he could have been up top, and I just missed him. And I suppose she isn't at present, right? Okay. Uh, if I go back to the front of the book, to the crew, you can see that this is slowly being filled out. Um, obviously, I haven't got the names of any of these guys yet. Presumably she... Martin? Big octopus. Uh, I don't think that guy is going to make it. Oh my word. Wait, no, I'm not ready yet. The Doom.
corpses moves post mortem. The ten other presents. Present. I don't know who they are yet, but they have a husband called Martin. Uh, crushed. Uh, I've buried. Struck. No. Strangled. Speared. Eaten. <sighs> Beast. I mean, wait. Oh, wait. No, no, no. This is the um, captain's wife. Oh, hang on. Oh, whoa. Why, why is that shaking? Why, why? Whoa. Oh, no. Uh. Excuse me? Whoa. Can't move. Oh. Okay. I was gonna I was gonna connect the dots. Okay, no, hold on. I'm not I'm not done yet. Uh Go to the ship crew. Alright, what's the name of the captain? Whittled? Uh, which will? Abigail. Okay, so her name is Abigail. Where were we, by the way? Uh... This may or may not be correct. What the hell does that mean? Fates are valued in sets of three. Are validated. Quickly identified at least three people and their fates will have information. What? Okay, so I guess I've not done enough yet to know. Oh my gosh, this is so confusing. Okay, hold on. I can't go through that way. I kind of love this. <laughs> okay. Uh, 